The CP Republic is brought to you by Smart and Talking Text. And hello, welcome to the uh, latest episode of The CP Republic. I'm si DR. And I'm Jam. Yep, so uh, wala po tayong new segment today kasi wala tayong ibabalitang bago sa no, sa larangan ng uh, ng uh, mobile phones. Uh-huh. Kasi parang ano nga yun eh. Slow Kung news week. Slow news week. Uh, wala Actually, ano. yung mga ganito talagang buwan eh. Madalas si slow news. Yeah. So, hopefully by uh, may Computex tayo na upcoming ano, sa ano, yep. sa May. So, hopefully meron tayo makuha na news about cell phones pagdating sa Taiwan. Yep. Mga ganon. And iba pang events na sa local. But the good news is, pero tayong ano, hands-on review segment. Yes. Mukhang hindi naman tayo mawawalan for the next uh, for the next few weeks. Hindi tayo nawawalan na cellphone eh. Yun ang show. Oo. Nakikilala na ang CP Republic eh. So, parati tayong pinapahinaman. So, ang uh, re-reviewin natin ngayong, ano, ngayong uh, weekend is the uh, Samsung Galaxy A5. Uh-huh. Uh, diniscuss namin to sa new segment nung ano, uh, last episode. And um, ano, um, basically ang aim ni Samsung is uh, mag-release ng high-end features, high-end specs, specs. Uh-huh. at the price na ma-afford ng karamihan. Actually, hindi lang specs, even the design. Mas, even ano even the design. Oh, uh, even yeah. the design. Gusto nila ma-experience nyo yung premium feel na isang Samsung smartphone at a much affordable price. Yeah, so... Uh, ano ba yung ano? Ano bang impressions mo dito, Jam? Uh, yeah. Sa, um, sa, S, uh, sa A6 tuloy. Sa A5. Okay, so A5. the A5 is similar to the S6. Sa totoo lang. Yung kanyang feel niya. Kasi yeah. una-una, salamin sa unahan. Metal sa sides. Salamin sa likod. Although yung kanyang design is mas less curvy. Mas more on squarish or rectangular yung design niya. Which is very, you know, which is actually yung... Know, Identif- identifier mo sa Galaxy A series eh. Mm-hmm. Na rectangular yung ano niya. Yung kanyang design talaga. So yun ang nakaretain sa, ano, eh, sa design ng, A- ng Galaxy A series. Oh, and A series is also metal. So ito rin naman metal. Pero this time, nag-glass na rin sila sa back. Actually, look at that. Ang ganda ng chamfered edges. Uh, although sa likod, hindi siya katulad ng S7 na curve yung likod. Mm-hmm. It's just flat. Parang S6 again. para S6 siya. And then, um, so unahan, Mukha nga siyang S6 sa unahan eh. Medyo maming mistake kami siya sa S6 pag di ka familiar sa mga phones. Kasi, uh, pati, tingnan nyo to. Itong home button. So, right. medyo familiar yung face niya, di ba? Pati yung gilid eh. Oo, oh, yung flat itong, yung side, di ba? Itong, itong gilid na to, mm. S6 na S6 ang dating. S6 na S6 talaga yung dating oh. niya. Ibang klase. Diba? Oh, so, ang gusto ko pa dito yung 2.5D glass. Ang oh, ganda yeah, ng 2.5D glass diba? niya. Parang nakaangat masyado yung 2.5D glass niya. So, pansin na pansin mo talaga. Lalo na pag nagre-reflect sa ilaw. Mm-hmm. So, ibang klase yung dating niya. Napaka-premium nung feel niya. Although sa likod, wala tayong, uh, ano, uh, yung heart rate sensor. Unlike oh, the S6. Ano, yung, heart, yung S6 may heart rate sensor. So, dun yung madaling madidistinguish if that's an S6 or an A5 2016. Mm, wide yung uh, Pero sa unahan, we still got, again, yung home button na may fingerprint yeah, sensor. That, that doubles as a fingerprint scanner. Okay. So, try natin. So, hindi siya yung katulad ng S5 na kailangan nyo swipe. Dito is patong nyo lang. And then, yan. So, madali lang siya. Yeah. Uh, hindi siya nakaka-stress gamitin. Right. Unlike yung sa S5 na kailangan pa swipe. Right. Even though no, for yata, swipe din. So, yan. That's the design part ng A5. Sa display naman, uh, it's actually uh, pretty good because this one is a super AMOLED display. Yes. Meron tayong 5.2 inch display similar to the S7 and then the A7 which is a bigger na version nito has a 5.5 inch na display similar naman sa S7 Edge. So unlike the S7, this one is not Quad HD. This one is just uh, Full HD. Pero still, ang ganda pa rin ng colors niya. Papansin nyo naman na pag malayo, um, talagang maliwanag yung colors na, maliwanag yung display kasi nga super AMOLED siya. And lalo na sa mga mahilig sa display na colorful, maliwanag, magugusan nyo talaga tong Galaxy A5 kasi again, super AMOLED yung display niya. Compared sa other display, super AMOLED talaga, mas vivid, mas maganda, mas maliwanag. So, although oversaturated yung dating niya pagdating sa display. Pero tingnan nyo yung bezel so, medyo manipis din yung bezel. Oh, wait, tama lang. 
Kasi siguro dahil nagdala din yung 2.5D glass, kaya ako rin siguro nagustuhan talaga. And so far, gusto ko talaga yung Full HD display. Tama, tama lang yung ano eh. Tama lang yung edges niya eh. Tama lang yung edges niya. Pero, Almost, no? Oo. Oh, pero ang ganda, ang ganda talaga. Na, ang ganda ng design ng A5 eh. Type ko talaga yung design ng A5. Siguro fan na lang talaga what ako yung design ng A7 S6. What for pa kayo sa A7? Na mas malaki. Oo, oh, mas malaki, di ba? So, right. para sa mga tablet na mahilig sa tablet na tao, magugustuhan talaga nila yon And ano pa ba? Um so ano ba tayo to performance? Yeah, let's you know, let's uh, check the performance. Actually, it was nagka problema ako dito sa A5 eh, no? Uh-huh. I couldn't take a screenshot. Talaga? Kasi, yeah, I mean power button. Hindi ko, and, hindi, yeah, the power buttons uh, and the volume ano. Actually, sa ho, sa Samsung is ano uh home button. Oh, it is a home button. Oh, uh, nasanay rin. Actually, pero, pero it's not only that. Pero yung, ano, diba normally si Galaxy series, you swipe it with your hand. Ah, yes, yes. Ito, oh. Diba, ano pa ganyan, right? Pero it doesn't work here. Pero baka uh, sa S7 or S6 or S5 lang yata. Or, I mean, kasi nasanay ako, eh, since the S3 days, eh. So, ah, yes. Oh, so it's a really good phone, the S3. Oh, so, I don't know kung sa A, A series hindi yata applicable. I'm not sure. Uh, pero anyway, uh, I was supposed to take a screenshot of my ano and of two, my two. benchmarks and two, two. Pero uh, well, in your case, you got forty one thousand. I got four thousand uh, forty thousand naman. No? So man, pas sabi kay performance niya is near parang Snapdragon six fifteen. Ganon yun tinatapatan niya. Right. Uh, pero mas better si six fifteen eh. Mas better si six fifteen. Yung well, well, the S five Pro is uh, in the K three note pareho silang ano tino o Mm-hmm. Parang gusto lang tumawag sa, sa Galaxy A5 in terms of uh, benchmark scores. Oh, and um, the... the, K, the ay, no, K3 note pala to. Sorry, K3 not note. K4 note. Ah, okay. K4 yeah. note yung bago. Yung bago na. yung K4 note. Yeah. yeah. X5 Pro, this is the one that they're going to release uh, pretty soon. Yung Vivo. Ah, oh, wala ano, pala. Uh, so much mataas. I, I'm not sure what uh, what they're using. I don't... I've really... For, actually, nakalimutan ko na eh. So, hindi ko alam. <laughs> Pero, um, uh, as close as 6.5, yes. Mm-hmm. I, I kind of agree with you to that. Um, pero, ano bang real-world na usage mo dito, Jam? Uh, real-world usage, so again, meron tayong uh, 41.652 na benchmark, benchmark na scores. And sa mga hindi nakakalam, this one is not using Snapdragon or a MediaTek processor. This one is using a uh, Exynos processor na gawa talaga ni Samsung. So, makikita nyo lang siya sa Samsung device. Right. And ang Exynos niya uh, has a frequency of uh, 1.6 gigahertz. Oh, napindot ko. Wait, ano ba? Nandun ba yung model? I'm not sure if nandun yung model. Kasi nakakalito yung model niya na Exynos eh. Pero, ano siya eh. Uh, hindi siya katulad na S6. Kasi S6 has like parang 60,070 na score. Which is sobrang taas. Uh, and then this one has a uh, Mali T720 na GPU. So, medyo okay yung, yung ano niya. Yung kanyang GPU. Kasi yung Adreno... 405, which is ginagamit ng Snapdragon 615, mas inferior compared sa Mali T720. So, um, so far, wala akong nagiging problema. When I'm using a uh, TouchWiz na UI, and wala naman ako napapansin na lags, wala akong napapansin na slow lags. Wala pa naman napapansin na lags. O, kasi ginagamit ko siya, normally sa ibang smartphones, ng Samsung ah, mm-hmm. uh, well, even S6 ah, naglalagay yung S6. After... Yeah. Siya, nagtotrottle yung kanya CPU after ng medyo mainit kasi yung S6 eh. Right. This one is not. Hindi siya sobrang init. Hindi rin nagtotrottle yung CPU na papansin ko. I'm playing Minecraft eh. Uh, always. It's my favorite game. Okay, let's, uh, let's try Minecraft on, on, mm. on the a Galaxy A5. So, uh, by the way, kaya wala akong NBA kasi nag-error yung NBA ko. Um, tingin ko yata may problema yata sa si Exynos. Something, siguro may something kasi to do even, with Exynos eh. Kasi even, do, even ma, ano eh. S7? Uh, even with the S7, uh, it's painful to play the NBA 2K16 sa ano, sa S7. I think it's an Exynos issue. Feeling ko rin Exynos issue eh. Kasi nag-error yung ano eh. Pero, uh, try na rin natin kasi ba, malay natin may update siya soon. Kasi bago lang din naman tong A5 eh. A5 2016, take note ha. This is A5, not... This is not A5 2016, 20, not, not the 2014 edition. Oh, and not the 2015. So, this is 2016. And mapapansin nyo na, dito pa lang, super smooth na siya. Kasi normally, sa iba, 
pag yung ganito na, and then yung re- render distance mo is mataas. Uh, normally, naglo-load pa yung iba dyan. Dito, hindi yan. Hindi siya naglalag. And mabilis naglo-load yung mga blocks from uh, doon sa malayo pa lang. So, so far, uh, ay- ayan no? Hindi, hindi talaga siya nagkakalag dito sa Minecraft, which is normally naglalag na sa ibang Snapdragon 615. Yung sa settings na render distance. And then, uh, minsan pa nga pag nagpapa-explode ako nito, uh, TNT, marami. Lagyan natin madami. So, yan So, ano natin? Pasabukin natin. So, normally, sa ganito, maglalag siya. Pero dito sa A7, tuloy-tuloy. Yun, actually, tumigil ng konti. Pero doon, uh, hindi siya katulad talaga ng, ng Snapdragon 615 na talagang sobrang uh, bagal niya. Uh-huh. Uh, once ano, as in, tumitigil siya. Dito, hindi eh. So, I'm quite Medyo satisfied lang. with the Minecraft dito sa Exynos. Although, again, it's Exynos, you might encounter some problems. Probably, ma- powerful nga siya. More, more powerful than the Snapdragon 615. And, probably katapat yung Helio processor. Yung mga Helio. Medyo malapit na. Although, hindi ko ma-assure sa inyo na lahat ng games malalaro nyo dito. Kasi nga, minsan may problems with Exynos processor. Like what we've mentioned, the NBA 2K16. Yeah, I think yun pala naman yung may issue eh. Oh, every, and uh, a software update would fix that. Every other game naman na nilalaro ko, okay naman eh. Oo, oh, right. Well, how about yung, ano, yung camera... Um, They improved the camera of the uh, of the A C of the A series 2016. Mm-hmm. Uh, suppo- Actually, uh, hindi na suppo- sobrang uh, improved na talaga. Suppo- oh, oh, kasi ano na yung aperture niya is now uh, 1.9. Mm-hmm. Uh, Mataas na yung ano niya. Oh, pero how do you find the ano? How do you find the pictures? Okay, so we have a 1.9 aperture, uh, even better than other flagship smartphones ng uh, local brands and uh, other uh, international brands. So far, I'm very uh, satisfied with it, kasi Sobrang ganda ng shots. Well, not kat- hindi siya katapat ng S7 or medyo malapit sa S6. Hindi ko masasabi na ka on par ni S6. Pero I'm very satisfied with it. So, ito, wala talagang ilaw nito. So, uh, nasa Batangas ako. Wala talagang ilaw. As in, na nagbibigay lang ng ilaw is itong dalawang street lights na to. Ayan. So, mapapansin nyo, ito, kitang-kita yung ilaw niya dito sa part na to. Sa may building na part. And maganda talaga yung ilaw niya. I mean, talagang mapapansin mo yung aperture niya. Mapasok na, talaga yung... Mapasok talaga yung ilaw. Lumiliwanag oh, talaga. Oh. Although compared sa S6... Able to get more light in. Yes. Na. Yes. Kasi mas mababang number doon sa aperture which means mas maraming ilaw ang pumapasok doon sa camera mo. Mm-hmm. Although the problem is uh, yes, maliwanag nga siya just like the S6. Medyo grainy lang talaga. Although mapagbibigyan ko pa kasi night shot eh. Pero sa S6 kasi mas better yung nakukuha ko na shots before. So... Isa pa tong shot na to, isa pa to. So, well, again, isa lang yung ilaw niya, pero medyo ano rin siya. Uh, mapapansin niyo yung talagang uh, ga- liwanag niya once na gamit niya in real life. Doon niyo mapapansin yung ano talaga na F1.9 na aperture. Um, shooting naman sa normal usage, I'm very satisfied with it. Okay naman siya, although ito medyo blurry ito. So, dito tayo sa, uh, sa strawberry. So, this one ha, comes with flash. And... Uh, Ang ganda naman niya. Ang ganda ng quality niya. Uh, detailed. The colors are right. Uh, so far, gusto ko yung kanyang mga kuha. And then, uh, I have here yung mineral wa- water. Makapansin nyo yan. No? So, detailed na detailed yung edges ng bawat ano dito sa ano. Sa nutrients na, nutrition facts ng mineral water. And then, this one din. Sa LG G5, makapansin nyo, basang basa. Yeah, basang basa. Basang basa. Maganda yung camera niya. Super. For a mid-range smartphone, talo niya pa ang other flagship smartphone sa camera niya. Nice. Well, uh, so, Ay, yeah. the battery life. We haven't talked about the yeah, battery, battery life. life. Oh. Yeah, so one of the improvements ng Galaxy A5 is yung battery life niya. This one I see 3,000 mAh. So, 3,000 mAh. Eh. Dati 2,500 lang yata. Eh. Mm, 2,000 yeah, parang 2,000 plus lang. And so far, tumatagal siya. Nagulat ako. Kasi... Actually, ganun yun. Yung mga averaging mga around, uh, well, 12 hours. Mga Umabot ako 13 eh. Hindi ko oh, lang kung bakit. Medyo more than average siya. Mm-hmm. And, hindi ko, nagulat ako eh. Kasi, hindi ko akalain na ganun tatagal tong A5. And, if you're asking me kung ano ba siya, kung A5 versus S6, mas tumatagal to kaysa S6. 
Yeah, sobrang def- layo ng difference. Yeah, definitely tatagal talaga kasi the S6 only has oh, uh, a battery, battery of eh. 2,500 oh, mAh. Sobrang liit ng battery ng S6. And oh. may issue pa with heating. So nakaka-affect din siya ng battery life. And so for dito, umabot ako ng more than average na na performance pagdating sa battery. Minsan hindi na ako nagdadala ng power bank eh. But it's not, uh, this is not as powerful as the S6 though. Yes, uh, it's not as powerful as the S6. Siyempre yung magtatanong din. Oh. So anong bibiling ko? Uh, should I buy a second-hand S6 or a cheaper brand new Galaxy S6 pag may nagmura or should I get ano, the A5. a Galaxy A5? Actually, magandang tanong yan kasi medyo kaparehas yung price range siya pag gray market or second-hand. Mm-hmm. Ang maganda niyan is pag naka A5 tayo, um, mas matagal yung battery life. Sure yun. Uh, mas bago siya. So, ibig sabihin, yung ibang software niya is mas bago. Mm-hmm. Um, although, pagdating naman sa S6, mas maganda yung camera, mas maganda yung performance, pero yung battery life niya, talo. So, ang pinakalamang talaga sa akin ni A5 is yung kanyang battery life. Okay. Alright. So, uh, yung uh, SRP nito is, uh, ano eh, is uh, 19,990. Yes, 19,990. Uh, um, and, uh, it's already available. You know, it's already available in uh, in uh, your favorite mobile phone shops. Uh, wala pa tayong news kung mag- mag- magiging available to sa mga telco carriers. Mm-hmm. Uh, pero there's a possibility that it will be carried. Hopefully, ma- ano na sa uh, ano. Kasi mas maganda siya. I mean, yung yung price range siya. More on ang kopsa eh, sa mga nagpa-plan eh. Maganda siya, actually, if ginawang plan. Yeah. So, I'm also liking this. And, uh, well... Uh, based on ano, based on your usage uh, actually mas ginamit mo to kaya sa akin eh. pero mukhang ano eh mukhang promising siya eh ano um, medyo, yung price lang talaga 99.90 I mean yes it's uh, medyo premium yung dating niya pero baka medyo hindi masikmura na iba na ganun yung presyo niya pero again you're parang ang kinocompare mo is parang malapit sa S6 but you're comparing a 36,000 peso phone to a 19,000 mm, exactly peso phone. exactly and, uh, we're not um, let's just put it this way Samsung will not be able to please everybody and mm. this is why they are a, they cannot give you ano you know, they cannot give you a 9,000 peso phone na mm. naka-glass na naka ano Hindi uh, pang ano yung market nila, hindi pang... Well, then, uh, and, and I don't think they will be able to do that. Yes, exactly. So, uh, hindi man sikura, then ibig sabihin, hindi siguro sila yung market. Yeah, yun na nga. Diba? Hindi hmm. Kasi may mga nagre-reklamo sa comment sections that's to. The, that's, the, that's the reality. Uh, ibig sabihin, you cannot afford it. Right? May nagre-reklamo kasi sa comments. Then, 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 this, is what, this is what the consumers need to learn. Eh. Ako, coming from the... Ano, uh, coming from the... Um, side of uh, of the brand no well uh, this is just my personal opinion though because i don't based lang sa usap-usapan namin mga brands parang if you, if you're complaining then you know you cannot ano you're you're not part of the market yes exactly six so, mean wala kang pera ano <laughs> ganun diba kasi if you have money then you will ano eh you will you will rethink yes. and then you will ano parang Okay naman, I can afford to buy pero ano uh, if if I'm going to buy the 36,000, what would I get what would I get more, hmm. di ba? Kung kaya na tong 20,000, hindi ko na sa 20,000. Yeah, and I think I think the ano, I think the price na sinasabi um to give ju- to give justice din naman sa brand. Uh I think it's priced quite fair naman. I, I don't understand why people are saying na mas mahal. Pero we're, you get a premium ano eh, feel eh. Akala mo nga S6, you, know, you have to remember guys that the premium prices of the phones are worth 32000 to thirty six, mm-hmm. and, the, and the value that they're giving you here is worth 19000 mm-hmm. And yet you get a ano, parang body na S6. Mukhang S6. Feel lang S6. Almost the same performance. Well, not uh, in terms of processing power. Mm-hmm. Pero yung experience of a flagship. They yeah. want, uh, Samsung wants you to experience a flagship smartphone at a much affordable price. Yeah. Yun yung ano niya for the A-series eh. Exactly. Alright, so Jenna, tatapos ang, ano, ang uh, episode namin uh, for the hands-on review segment. Uh, thank, uh, thank you to Samsung uh, for uh, lending us uh, the review units. And, uh, well, we'll see you uh, next, uh, next, uh, next weekend. Uh... For a new, no, for a new episode. Hopefully, may news na tayo. Yeah, hopefully. Kung wala man, 
Yung wala. <laughs> De, mer- pero meron pala tayo. Baka na sa ibang venue tayo. Baka nga. <laughs> Baka nga. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Pang inggit ba? <laughs> <laughs> Sarap pang inggit, no? <laughs> Sige. All right. So um, that's all. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and uh, we'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.